Learning the correct way to march isn't your usual classroom activity, but then again this isn't your usual lesson. The Welsh Guard took over the morning class and gave the Year 9s at Fix a chance to learn about life in the army. So we're down here this morning to engage with the local community and give the kids an insight into both what we do here in the Falklands and also back home in uh, Windsor in the UK. So naturally we had to start with some drill. So we had Guardsman Owen and Guardsman Owen giving a drill lesson to the uh, 20 boys we've got us this morning. I think uh, both sides of that equation enjoyed it. The Guardsman enjoyed instructing it and uh, the kids really got stuck into it. So uh, we've got some natural drillers there. Then we went through some survival stuff, some bash erection and eating out in the field, showed them, got them open up the ration packs, uh, cooking with some jet balls and uh, the kids enjoyed eating muesli and hot chocolate. And now we've got the kids out on the field doing some command tasks, so hopefully using a bit of brain and some brawn to overcome some of the problems that we're going to uh, present them this morning. But on the whole, they've been pretty engaged and I think they were quite, in, quite excited before uh, we got down here to, to get stuck in. As you can see, they're all cam creamed up to their eyeballs and they've all been crawling around, which I think they've enjoyed. While this was a one-off session, it could lead into much more marching in future. If the training proves popular in future, there may be the opportunity to create a cadet's blanche in the islands. Certainly that, that, that is something that we're, we're looking into and the new head of curriculum, Gavin Roberts, is talking to FIDF and, and others about, about getting that off the ground.